So again here we want to solve the equation for the given variable. Our equation is a equals one half b times h for h. We want to solve for h. Now we might recognize this form one half base times height, the formula for a, uh, the area of a triangle. That's what they get this equation for, and we want to get h by itself. Okay. So to get h by itself, we have this one half base times height of a over here. So we notice that there's multiplication between the one half and the b and the h. Uh, there's a multiplication going on there. So let's go opposite of multiplication is division. Okay. But that might not help us here because we have a one half. We know if we multiply, um, we could divide by one half if you wanted to both sides, which is the same thing as multiplying by a two. So I'm going to rewrite this, but I'm going to write and multiply both sides by two. Now remember, we're multiplying the whole right side by two. But since this is multiplication, we don't have to distribute. It cancels out that one half, that's a goal, and we're left with 2a equals b times h, okay? So again, we want to get h by itself, so the next step we would have to do, well, we have multiplication here, so we have to divide by the letter b. Now, b is just some arbitrary number, we don't know what it is right now, okay? But it is what it is, and so now we divide by b, they cancel out, and we're left with 2a over b equals h. So we can rewrite that to be h equals 2a over b. And we can make a little note here where, where what? Where b does not equal 0. Because again, we cannot divide by 0, and that is important to know. So h here is equal to 2 times a over b, where b is not equal to 0. Uh, thank you for watching this video, and please subscribe to our YouTube channel.